Amanda, you mentioned Hollywood before. That's because you're excited. Hollywood is back in Macon, and from January 2nd to the 13th, Garden Films Productions is filming the sci-fi movie, The Fifth Wave. 41 NBC's Kenley Hargit has more on the movie's economic impact and how the production is going so far. Production crews are hard at work making sets and creating the scenes for a new sci-fi movie called The Fifth Wave. We need an urban environment, like a downtown area, but still not, you know, like a, like a huge big city and making just fit the bill. A. Todd Holland says the next two weeks, the song and soul of the South will be transformed into Dayton, Ohio after an alien invasion. People prep, people plan, we do everything we can to make sure it does go smoothly and, and, and everybody's happy. Making Film Commissioner Terrell Sandifer says the movie will bring in $400,000 to the city and the production company will save money. Georgia offers a 30% tax credit. So that means basically if a film has, their budget is 100%, it only costs them 70% of their budget. Most of the filming will happen between Cotton Avenue and Cherry Street. Many of the businesses along the streets are excited to see the actors and behind the scenes workers in town. That's because it means they'll see a boost in sales. There's a lot of commotion around it. It uh, kind of stirs things up and um, helps promote business. But Jeffrey Hill of the vault is one of many stores closing its doors to give the film company more space to shoot the scenes. We've worked with this company before and uh, with the movie 42 and they completely changed everything and then they completely changed it right back just like it was before. Hill adds just because he won't open doesn't mean he won't make money. No, they have uh, compensated us for that. The fifth wave is just one of many movies filmed in middle Georgia. Holland also hinted making could be seen in other films seen on the big screen. It's beautiful. People have been real nice. It's gorgeous. You've got a great city here, great infrastructure. It fits uh, kind of like Middletown America. In Macon, Kenley Hargett, 41 NBC News. Pretty cool stuff right there. Now each day of filming, there's going to be different streets blocked off. Tomorrow, starting from 7 in the morning until 7 at night, traffic and sidewalks will be closed on Cotton Avenue between Mulberry and Cherry Streets. And then traffic and sidewalks will also be closed on 2nd Street between Mulberry and Cherry Streets.